whether you're currently in a storm, headed towards one, or coming out of one, we all have struggles. The person that I am today is because of the struggles that I've gone through. And the problem is, is we always learn that in hindsight. When you were going through it, you didn't realize what you know now. Now you look back at that as, as, as with like your, like your hat says, grateful. Like you're grateful for having gone through that. But the person that's going through it right now as they're watching this, they don't know that yet. And it's really easy for us to sit up here and say like, in hindsight, you'll understand it'll all <laughs> yeah. make sense and everything will just be clear one day. And they're like, yeah, screw you. Because yeah, they're because in that, it. Whatever struggle you are going through right now, it is not fatal. Um, your life is not over. As long as you are still breathing, you have time and you have time to change everything, turn everything around. And what I just know, and I just know it because I know it from experience, is that there is a purpose in whatever that struggle is that you're going through right now. There's purpose in whatever that pain is that you're feeling right now. And the blessing that is on the other side of it, you will not be able to receive it until you understand the purpose of what you're going through. One of my favorite quotes is, you know, when the, when the, when the reality pain of the current situation becomes greater than the fear of change, like that's when change happens. So when you become so uncomfortable where you really are, that you're like, I don't give a shit what it takes, legitimately, because most guys say, I don't give a shit what it takes. When you say, okay, here's what it takes. Oh, whoa, 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 I can't tell my truth. You can't tell her, whoa, 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 whoa. So you're not in enough pain yet. And so when you get to that space where you're like, I fucking, I, I'm dying inside. I don't want this anymore. What do I have to do? And you say, you know, do this. And they're like, okay, I'll go do it. And then all of a sudden they find that liberation. It's like, oh shit, this is what's possible. This is what I can have. The crazier, the more horrible and terrible their situation was, is almost like proportionately where they go to. Absolutely. Like it's, it's but to be able to know when you're in it, that in order for you to receive the blessing on the other side of it, you have to become the person that can. And you can know that there is a reason for your struggle. There is a purpose in your pain. And that if you know that I'm going through this to become, to grow into the person that can handle what's next, that can become the person that's able to receive that blessing that's on the, on the other side of it, then that is the ultimate encouragement. All these terrible things I'm so incredibly grateful for them because they made me who I am. And, and that's the biggest encouragement that I can give for anyone that's going through anything or has gone through anything, like use it. Like use that to propel you forward, not use it to let you just stay where you're at. Was the courage to keep moving forward regardless of where you are right now that ultimately sets you apart from the rest. It's ultimately what sets you apart, um, the good from the great. Um, the, the successful from the, the legendary, the successful from building a legacy. And, and that's what it's all about, is the courage to continue.